Santa Fe's Raton subdivision is about much more than merely having fun with scale trains. The purpose of this model railroad, is to bring history to life, with fine modeling skills. Raton Pass was chosen for the location of our model railroad for several reasons. Santa Fe Railway history is deeply rooted in Raton Pass as far back as 1878, and the development of Santa Fe's locomotives, especially steam, was greatly influenced by the steep grades of Raton Pass. At first, the Santa Fe built a switchback system of track to get trains over the pass. The switchback was an incredible 6% grade on both sides of the pass. No railroad today can imagine such a steep grade for a Class 1 railroad. When the tunnels were built the grade was reduced to 3.5%, even so, the grades of Raton Pass are the steepest in the United States for a Class 1 railroad. The model railroad's duplication of the steep grades, and the historic region of Raton Pass, is the perfect setting to highlight the Santa Fe Railway's unique history. The real pass is located between the towns of Raton, New Mexico and Trinidad, Colorado, and it is the most grueling, 23-mile section, of steep grade railroading in the nation. Our model railroad of course is a much shorter distance but being built with the same grades as the prototype, tests the endurance of the model locomotives as they climb and then descend the pass, giving our viewers an exciting experience. The Santa Fe Railway put down rail in Trinidad on September 10, 1878. Rapid growth of railroad facilities followed quickly with Santa Fe building a freight depot, a car repair shop, coal chute, passenger depot, roundhouse and turntable. All of these steam locomotive servicing facilities are long gone and the only thing remaining today is the Amtrak station. It was impossible due to available space to model the entire town on the layout. Instead, we chose to represent a portion of the freight yard. We were also able to represent State Highway 160 overpass and an elevated section of Interstate 25. The Santa Fe Railway reached Willow Springs Ranch, the future site of Raton, in the winter of 1878. By 1882, Rail facilities included a main shop, blacksmith shop, boiler house, car shop, roundhouse, coal house and transfer table. When steam locomotives were replaced by diesels in the 1950s, the steam-related facilities were removed. Once again, due to space limitations on the layout, only a portion of the freight yard in Raton is represented. Specifications Name, Santa Fe's Raton Subdivision Scale, HO Size, 14 by 32 mainline area and 12 by 12 Trinidad slash Raton freight yards Prototype, Atchison, Topeka and Santa Fe's Raton Subdivision Period, Spring 1980 Location, Trinidad, Colorado to Raton, New Mexico Layout style, linear walk around Length of mainline, 98 feet, layout height, 40 to 47 inches. Benchwork, birch plywood modules. Roadbed, 1 inch styrofoam over 3 eighths inch plywood. Track, Atlas Code 83. Turnouts, number 6 Atlas Code 83. Minimum curve radius, 31.5 inches in freight yards, 36 inches on mainline. Maximum grade, 3.5%. Scenery, styrofoam structure covered with plaster cloth. Ground cover, woodland scenics with tile grout shading. Backdrop construction, masonite panels. Backdrop scene, photorealistic of actual location. Fascia, half inch by eight inch Baltic birch plywood. Fascia paint, Sherwin Williams, 6181 Secret Garden, Turnout Control, Caboose Industries and Scale Ground Throws. Skirting, Black rayon curtains. Operating session development, Aaron A. Teague. Operating rules, adopted from Atchison, Topeka and Santa Fe operating rules by Sam D. Teague. 
electrical, bus, 12 gauge, stranded wire. Track feeders, 22 gauge, stranded wire. Lighting, Lithonia 48 inch track lighting bars with LED daylight floods. Control, Digitracks digital command control with Wi Fi throttles. Decoders, Tsunami 2.